I've been meaning to get to round 100 with a melee weapon for a long time now, and with the scythe being released recently, it feels like a perfect storm for me to attempt it. So today, we'll be trying to get to round 100 with the scythe. All right, uh, I decided we're going to do this on Forsaken. It's been a while since I've gotten a round 100 on Forsaken, and plus there's going to be a lot of special elites here that can make it interesting. On top of that, the first room on this map is one of my favorites. I love that the rounds just start flying by, and that's going to help us out a lot for getting through these early rounds fast. And since we do have the super Easter egg done and we have the scythe purple tier, we can kind of hang out here for a while and just rack up some points. Uh-oh, uh-oh, this is not good. I'm already cornering myself, but I went ahead and I already picked up death perception that way i can start building up scrap gonna need to be repairing my armor quite a bit this game probably gonna buy some decoys some stuns maybe some nades and maybe even some death machines to deal with abominations i'm not too sure how the scythe does against them so i might need a little backup when it comes to uh, them spawning in but the field upgrade i chose to go for today is tesla storm i might be switching it out uh depending on how often i'm repairing my armor i might just use frenzied guard or if i feel like that's not working and i i just need a oh shit button uh, I might just switch to Aether Shroud instead. But something cool about the Scythe, if you guys haven't seen it being used in zombies yet, is that this can kill more than one zombie in a swing. So let me try to get a nice group of them right here. Make sure that I'm not coring myself when I go for this. Let's take a nice swing at them. That was a three kill swing right there. I think it can kill up to four zombies in one hit. So this thing's kind of nasty. It might not have the fastest swing speed, but it being able to kill a few at the same time with that upgraded melee perk where you get health back with every time you do damage with it. This thing could be a menace. Oh, is that double points? Zombies, I need you guys to get away from that here. Get stunned. Let me go ahead and grab that from you. And let's pop our Tesla Storm and get 20 points for each one of these zombies that we, we get electrified. We're just racking up points right now. Look how fast our points are going up. We just went from 10,000 to like 20,000 in an instant. And we have another double points already ready. But I think I'm going to really lean into using ammo mods and probably just training around here in spawn room. You know, once we get power on and we get pack a punch and everything. But I think for this one, I'm going to have to be extremely patient. I'm not going to have the luxury of just popping some ring of fires and blasting zombies away with whatever wonder weapon. I'm going to have to try to go in for a swing and back up so I don't get windmilled and absolutely destroyed by a horde of zombies. This one might take a bit, but I'm here for the ride. Ooh, ooh, that was not good. These zombies are not messing around. No, 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 no. Okay. I really got to pay attention to when my Tesla storm's ending. That's our first down of the day. It's happening on what? Round 15. We still haven't left the spawn room. So maybe, maybe that's the, the game telling me, hey, get, get the hell out of here. Go ahead and start getting power on. And I should probably listen. Oh my God. There's a mimic. Oh, and he doesn't want to go down easy. Can I buy a self revive back? I can. Let's go. <laughs> Crazy that I already have enough for a self revive. We're grinding over here. Let's get that stun out. Try to stun again. I really want to take care of this mimic. But I can't hit him. There we go. Give me that armor. Thank you. And let's start our portal up. All right. I'm going to re-grab our death perception real quick. Hopefully I don't get knocked. No, please. Oh, that was close. That was so close. All right. We're leaving. Through the portal. We barely made it out of our first room, but we got out with like 55,000 minus what we just spent on perks. That's not bad for the first 15 rounds. We can just grab everything on the way to power. Oh shit, there's already an abomination. Okay, I'm gonna try to get a Tesla storm and take this thing out. Ow, it immediately broke my armor. I'm gonna run through here. I'm grabbing stamina up. Please don't kill me. Thank you. I'm gonna grab quick revive just in case and so I can get that faster health regen. All right, come here, abomination. It Tesla stormed. Oh, this does not do a whole lot to you, does it? I need you to open your mouth for me. Go ahead. Open wide. Oh, yeah, this is doing nothing. I have no idea how we're going to kill the abomination to get the power. Oh, I got to run. Okay, so even a purple tier scythe, no pack a punch, doing nothing against the abomination. That's bad. All right, where are our parts? Uh, there's one of them. Okay, where's our little TV? There it is. Uh, where's the flashlight? It's behind the counter. Give me that. Let's head into Burger Town. Get our shit the Aki way. Give me the fryer. Oh, no. This abomination is a menace. I'm hopping up here and grabbing Elemental Pop. We're gonna need it. Maybe I can get a Shatter Blast going or something on him. Okay, I cut open one of his heads. Come here. There you go. Oh, no charge at me. Don't you do it. Come here. Nope. Nope. Oh, that hurt. Actually, no, it didn't. Did not hurt as much. You need to sit down. 
Okay, we finally took it out. So it is possible. Let's craft our teleporter and make our way into the underground part of the map. All right, other abomination. I'm going to need you to spawn in right now. What's going on, pal? Give you the triple kiss, the quadruple kiss, actually. Let me upgrade our armor. Let's do that. We got it to level two. And our brain rod zombie is going on a rampage, taking out all of the normal zombies. Gonna give us a chance to take on this abomination 1v1. Okay, maybe not 1v1. You had two little zombie friends. Come here. Let me hit your face. There we go. Yeah, go ahead and throw up your smoke screen. This thing does no damage to him. I don't know how we're gonna take one of those out at like round 90 if we even get there. Come here. Sit down. Night, night time right now there we go all right lockdown has been lifted let's grab phd while we're here and we'll get our pack a punch tears first there's a pack a punch one on the scythe this thing looks beautiful the scythe has really good coverage this thing looks great let's grab pack two and shatter blast and get out of here before i die go ahead and spawn mimic i dare you idiot now i'm scared of no elites a single elite does not scare me even you other mimic where's my shatter blast at i need you to go off right now there it is that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's grab some more of our perks. We'll get Speed Cola, Mule Kick, uh, Deadshot. Try not to die. And all that's left is Tombstone and then Pack 3 and we're all set up. Oh no, there's another Abomination. We have another Abomination, but we have Pack-A-Punch now. Let's see if this is any better against them. Ooh, not looking like it. These Abominations are tanky as hell. He's just eating shots from this thing. But we do finally have enough money for pack three. So let's grab that. And I think we're fully set up. The only thing we really need to do is upgrade our scythe to uh, gold tier. But besides that, we have every perk. Our scythe is fully packed. I think we can turn on the rampage inducer. So we throw on a decoy so the zombies don't kill me while I'm doing it. And that's probably going to be something that I regret. These zombies are already hitting pretty hard. The abominations are already kind of crazy. But you know what? Let's make it crazier. But if in a few rounds you see that I don't have it turned on, mind your business. I got scared, probably. No, 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 no. We are not going down right now. It's not happening. All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to switch to Frenzy Guard now. I feel like armor is definitely going to be our main priority here. And if we can just hit a button and get full armor, I'm down with it. Plus, with this Rampage Inducer on, it's going to be a little nice refresher to have all these zombies, like, slowed the hell down for a minute. Oh, shit. That abomination scared me. There we go. Split his head wide open. Hit him in the asshole. A nice one-two combo. Let's frenzy guard. Take this bad boy out. There we go. And a nuke on top of it. We take those. But while we have a second without zombies here, I'm going to go ahead and grab me a death machine. Because abominations, pretty difficult to kill. Going to need a little help with those. So I think this is going to be our strat for the day. Run around until all the zombies are in a nice big pile here. And then shatter blast the shit out of them. And take out damn near all of them. Excuse me, zombie. Are you okay? There you go. That was weird. He just hopped right out of the window and just stood there. It's like he forgot what he was supposed to do. These things spawn so frequently. How many abominations are there? Is there one like every three rounds? Do they normally spawn that frequently? I just don't remember. Come here, bitch. Damn, we're just going back and forth. This thing's way too tanky. Insanely tanky. I don't want to have to use my death machine this early of a round, though. Good night. All right, we can finally upgrade our scythe to gold. Now it's at the max potential damage. Hopefully this thing can last us. Because we're like barely even a, over a quarter of the way there. All right, let's see how this does against the abomination now that we have it fully armored up or leveled up, damaged up. Whatever. It took three strings. That's not bad. I don't know if we hit an ammo mod in the middle of that that it's weak to, but that definitely speeds up our process of killing those guys. It was actually a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I thought we'd be able to breeze through this. Shatter Blast would, would do most of the work. And, it, you know, Shatter Blast is doing work right now, but holy shit. The scythe is way weaker than I thought. No! What? It just laser me through the wall? Dickhead. Get out of here. I need to go get my perks back. All right, so it took until round 42 for us to go down again. That's not a bad spread. We just got to keep these downs to a minimum, though. But we got them all back. Oh, the abomination almost took us out with his laser again. 
dickhead. Also, I did switch back to Tesla Storm over Frenzy Guard. These guys are frozen for some reason. Why does that keep happening here? But I figured that the Tesla Storm would help against Abominations more because it does do a little bit of damage to them. And Frenzy Guard does give us armor back, but it also only lets us take damage through our armor. So it wasn't that helpful against the Abominations. I think Tesla Storm would be better. Plus, if we do end up getting an insta-kill while having Tesla Storm, just every zombie around us dies just by us merely walking by it. So let's use the Tesla Storm on the Abomination. Hit it right in its dome. We still barely do any damage to this thing. That is not good. Eat this. There you go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's also not good is me putting myself in a corner over here. I gotta stun my way out. Woo. This is getting tough. Look how satisfying Shatter Blast is. Ready? We have this giant group of zombies. Takes out almost all of them. And that's what I'm talking about with Tesla Storm too. We'll grab this insta-kill, pop the Tesla Storm, and then everything just starts dying around us. We don't really have to hit these elites, but they all just start melting. Just run around and just get easy kills. Uh-oh. Until it runs out and you almost die. What the hell? The zombie's in the floor. What the hell are you doing? You're not supposed to be in there. How's that even happen? Did you get Goomba stomped into the ground? I guess you can just watch all your friends get shatter blasted. No, 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 no. Not going down here. Nope. Woo, that was close. I am just dicking around too much. No, 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 no. Fuck. I got to stop training so close to that wall and I hit my Tesla storm and it was just a little too late. I don't think any zombie is going to get close enough for me to electric chariot. So I'm just going to go ahead and self-revive. I think there's not that many zombies left. Let me grab our self-revive back and I'm going to go get my perks back again. Plus two downs now in the 40s. That's not good. We should not be having more and more downs as we go. We need to tighten up and do better. Open your fucking mouth. Open it now. Come on, Abomination. Let me see them pearly whites. There we go. What? Why is there two of you in a round now? That's fucked up. No, what? I just got wombo comboed by a Mimic and a Mangler. Mimic held me in place while the Mangler shot me. Damn, it's not looking good. It's been like 10 rounds and we've gone down 45 times. No, 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 no. Oh, one health. Literally one health. Shout out Jug for saving my life there and not making me go rebuy all my perks again. I keep going down the same exact spot and I'm not learning. All right, we have reached health cap. It's taken so long to get here. You guys have no idea how long melee weapon round 100 takes. But on health cap, let's see what it does. First, we have to get our shatter blast out of the way. Get a nice swing on him. Ooh, took out damn near all of them. But against a normal zombie... Still one shots a health cap, so that's good. They're not like the size. It's not going to be a two hit kill. Love to see that. Love to see melee weapons still one shotting at max health. Because when they don't, it's super annoying. And the rampage inducer is deactivated, which is a little unfortunate. There's going to be a little more time in between rounds now. I really do like how fast it is between rounds with the rampage inducer on. But I'm glad that, uh, actually, I don't think anything really changes. I think the rampage inducer just goes until zombies are already super sprinting in swinging as hard as possible. So nothing changes, but the rounds just get a little bit longer to go through. But I guess we reached our first like big milestone. We're over halfway there. We're making our way. No, I'm going down. I'm going down. Fuck. Oh, the nade got me back up though. What's not good is I don't have a Tesla storm and I can't get one until this insta kill wears off. All right, we need to come up with a plan to save us. I think I know what to do. Get all these zombies up here. We're gonna toss a quick nade. That'll give us some nice progress towards our Tesla Storm. And now we're out of nades. So that plan has gone out the window unless there's someone on the ground. No, I'm going down. I'm going down. I'm going to be the thing on the ground. Let's stun these guys. Give me a second to breathe. Grab to C4. We'll use that. That's a good amount of kills. We're almost there. No, no, no. I'm going down again. Okay, at least I still have my self revive. Oh, there's a nuke too. There we go. That'll give us some time to buy our self-revive back. All right, I'm popping Tesla Storm, grabbing everything back. And then these disciples are going to die. And this Mangler. We are also extremely low on money now. We're only at 68,000. Can't even make a joke out of it. No! I'm a fucking idiot. I'm down again. Ooh, good thing though is that we can use the scythe while we're down to get ourselves back up. Oh no, I'm going down again. Fuck. Now we're at 69,000 after we go down. We made it. We did it. And okay, not that many zombies left. I have some time to get these back. Unless a disciple wants to be a fucking dick. Huh? You want to be a dick about it? You want to die instead? I think you do. Never mind. He's sucking the soul out of me. Suck that, bitch. Oh, wait. He did. Suck a little more. 
Abomination, you suck some too. I still need to get some of my perks back before this round starts. Okay, there we go. Got everything back. No, no, no way. I'm going to go down in the same spot again. Not happening. Please throw some stuns. I'm tossing every stun I have. Woo! No idea how I made it out of that or why I keep going in that same spot. I just can't help myself. No, and I'm right back on the same fucking spot. I almost died again. It, that area feels like it's the most wide open to train at. And then I always just end up right in the corner of the stairs, like dying, pleading for my life. We did it. We made it to the sex round. Hopefully I don't get fucked on this round though. It's been a while since I've been down. Hopefully I'm not jinxing it. Knock on wood. All right, we made it through without getting fucked. Oh no, I'm a fucking idiot. All right, well, the round ended. We made it to 72, but that's our first down in a while. I just walked right into a horde of zombies and I was like, you know what? Yeah, let's do this. No, 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 not going down again. Oh, we got the Gersh off. That got us right back up. I'm throwing down another. I'm buying all of our perks back for the hundredth time. I'm out of here, maybe. No, I think I'm going down again. Yep. Oh wait, made it out. Hit the portal, go! Woo. No, no, no. This is not very good. Not the laser. Did that actually do nothing to me? What am I in like spawn protection or something? But surprise, surprise. We went down again and we don't have a death machine to deal with this abomination. I didn't realize mine was low on ammo. I just ran out of it. So I'm gonna try to nade these zombies, get my Tesla storm back. There we go. I right, go over here, use my Tesla storm, grab armor back. Hopefully not die by this fucker's laser. Let's see if we can take him out. Come on. Whoa, I got launched way in the air. What the hell? I've never seen that before. <laughs> the amount of times we've been going down is crazy. We're at 11, 11 downs. Honestly, I was kind of expecting more. No, where, where'd my swings go? That was back to back swings that didn't hit. That one's bullshit. I don't care if I'm right by the steps. That one was not on me. What the fuck? That one, I don't know what happened. I was by the cursed stairs. I think that's what happened. No! Yeah, I'm starting to think these stairs are actually like pretty fucking cursed. Okay, we're officially broke. I have 4,000 points after getting all my perks back after that dumbass down. We've gone down 14 times so far. No! Okay, so it's not the stairs. I'm just stupid. I'm nowhere near the stairs. I'm on the opposite side of the fucking spawn from the stairs. Oh, not fucking again. Damn it. We're almost pushing 20 downs here with only 16 rounds to go. Um, I can't move. There we go. I'm down again. I can't. I'm moving my mouse. Look, I'm rubbing it on my hand. Nothing's moving. This is the worst time to have a technical issue. Okay, it's moving now. Oh, we're going to hit our Tesla storm and go get our stuff back. Uh oh, the fucking stairs strike again. I swear I'm not doing this on purpose. We've made it to round 90, only 10 rounds to go. And we're two downs away from 20. They will hit both goals by then. What? All right, well, we might be getting to 20 downs uh, earlier than I thought. Zombie, come here. Get a little closer to me, please. Thank you. Okay, and well, there's 20. Walked right back into him. I was just trying to train around, you know, build up a Tesla storm, but no. They don't want me to do that. I'm gonna try to get some perks back this way. The old fashioned way, going to each of their individual machines. Maybe not every single individual machine. Oh yeah, that's probably why I shouldn't have done that. Fuck, we're in quite the predicament. We have no self revive, no quick revive, barely any points, and we're only 10 rounds away. Grabbing quick revive. Hopefully I don't die while drinking it. Cool, we made it that far. Let's grab Jug while we're right here. We got all the OGs now. What really sucks is not having stamina up. Cause these zombies are fast as shit. Okay, let's stun these guys. Hit them with a shatter blast. I think that got like four zombies. That's awful. Bounce the nade off the wall, come get it. There we go, that's a Tesla storm. All right, we should be good to get our stuff back now. All right, we got all of our perks back. Hopefully we don't go down again. Hopefully we can go the next 10 rounds without dying. But I, I've said that every time after I've gone down and it has not worked yet. Fuck. Oh shit. I do have quick revive still. I don't have a self revive though. It only showing tombstone scared the shit out of me. All right, we got everything back, including a self revive. <sighs> I can't believe we made it this far. With the amount of times I've gone down, this game should be over. Fuck. No. Oh fuck. I almost made it all the way out. One zombie stopped me. Shit. No! Let me out! 
Ooh. This whole video is just me going down for however long it is. Oh, wait. Let's add another one to it. Let's make it a compilation. Oh, wait. We're fighting our way out. We're gamers. We're gaming hard. Oh, wait. Wait. Nope. There it is. That's it. Right there. Okay. Now add another one to the list. 25. No. No. <gasps> no. We made it to round 95. 95. Look, here's our final stats. 13,000 eliminations, 1,000 crits, 26 downs. The 26th down being our very last down. I'm so disappointed in myself. I've played for four hours and 40 minutes using the scythe just to get five rounds away from what we were going for to lose. I would have much rather died at like round 70, round 80. That was just so close that I know it was obtainable and it was just me fucking up that made it so that we didn't get it. <sighs> well... I mean, the scythe, it's, it's, it's all right. It's not the greatest weapon out there. Uh, thank you for focusing camera. This thing always goes out of focus whenever I'm full screen, but I mean, it is kind of fun to use. Definitely a very, very slow way to get to round 100. If you want to try that, but let me know what you guys think about the scythe. Is it good in zombies? Do you like it? You think it's bad? I think it's honestly low tier melee weapon, but it looks cool, but I've been recording for entirely too long. So if you guys like this and you want to see more, go and leave a like on it. If you didn't and you don't dislike, if you're new here, please consider subscribing, put out all kinds of COD content throughout the week. Uh, if you want to keep up with me outside of YouTube, go ahead and follow my Instagram, and my Twitter links. To those should be in the description below. Also, a link to my discord will be there if you want to join that, but that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.